Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Ellison Cruz, and getting caught in cutscenes is easily one of my favorite ways to welcome you back to Mario and Rabbids Kingdom Battle, where not even moments ago I just had to come up with a, a sneeze to go ahead and ruin the flow of recording because for whatever reason, every single time I sit down and prepare myself to begin recording, I set up the mic and I just, you know, pop my ass down on the couch. I just immediately have to sneeze. It's like I have a, the compromised nervous system of a 98-year-old reclusive hermit who lives in the woods. And for whatever reason, I just can never have an unstuffy nose. It's probably one of the worst things. And I was hoping that while talking our way back here, I would have been able to get it out. But clearly, it's just, just going to dwell on the back of my throat until the most inopportune moment. But last time... We went ahead and took on the uh, back leg of the spooky trail, and in this one, boy, are we gonna finish it. This is a treat. It's a fantastic little fight. I mean, it itself isn't that great, but if you guys are a fan of Conker's Bad Fur Day, I think you might uh, find a little bit of joy here. So prepare yourself, because uh, once we step through the gate and do all this business, we're gonna be confronted with yet another boss fight where uh, you cannot use or change your characters or their skill sets. So we'll just review those real fast just so you guys know. So I'm taking in Rabid Peach and uh, Yoshi as well. Uh, I do have, uh, you know, some pretty good stuff on them. Got my dashes in there and I don't entirely think it's necessary for much else. Just some extra health just in case. We're going to be pretty far from each other and... Uh, just want to make sure that, you know, we can actually survive our on our own for a little bit. So well, let's hope that uh, this is a good enough loadout and prepare ourselves to take on whew, the Phantom of the Spooky Trail. Why, it's a theater! Tom Fan sure has a flair for the dramatic, doesn't he? Beepo, just a quick note to let you know my email was hacked. Hello to 2019. Please ignore any messages about a Mr. Tom fan as I suspect it's a trap. Though no doubt you figured that out for yourself already as I'm sure it was as obvious to you as it was to me. Signed, your biggest fan. We should have known. Since Donkey Kong, seething down every pipe, despite his plum shaped body type, who's <laughs> gonna run in fear while screaming, Mamma Mia, who leaves me gray and grim? Oh, what does Peach see in Great joy in my heart. Each time I watch Mario Kart, you're first and doing so well. But here come the Spanish. <laughs> and now you and your rabbi friends have finally met your end. 
Just let me catch my breath, then I'll die. See you today. Ladies and gentlemen, can I just say a round of applause for everyone involved with that? Because, as uh, historically inaccurate as uh, you know, a spiny shell in first place is, fantastic song. I love it. My senses indicate that Mr. Uh, from the Phantom is immune to attack when he's talking the spotlight. This greedy songbird is singing his swan song. We must find a way to turn off those lights. Indeed. The only way we could do that, unfortunately, is by running into them. Uh, and we cannot shoot them. So let's go ahead and power ourselves up. Uh, I started this fight and I realized I had a couple of uh, mistakes in my loadout, so I changed them. Sorry. Um, so a, a couple of different things and I was just like, why why did I let myself do that ahead of time? I should have just, I don't know, given myself more warning. But I'm going to start off by putting uh, Rabbit Yoshi right here. Uh, once we destroy the single light, um, he'll be vulnerable, so let's give that a go. And I uh, hope we can do some good business with that. My spotlight! And now he'll be vulnerable. Now, much like many of the other fights, um, he has three phases. And the next phase will be set up over here where we have to destroy two lights. And then in his third phase, three lights over here. So we're going to have to go ahead and move accordingly, but I think we'll be fine. Uh, he does have a couple of Valkyries here, which are not going to be much of an issue, but we should be careful because uh, they can protect uh, Mr. Phantom here in case, you know, they want to absorb some of that damage. Now, Phantom himself isn't too bad. He does have a brand new ability called Stone Death, which is a close proximity villain sight where if you're caught inside of it, you're going to be frozen and turned to stone, and that is kind of the worst, so we'll kind of need to try to stay away from that, but... He happens to do it at the worst times. Alright, well thank you. Um, so, if I get... Ooh, that percentage is not very promising. 25% to a critical. If I got a critical, I could kill him in one turn. That would be kind of good. But maybe we'll try this. Let's go for this. <laughs> We're just gonna get this all out of the way as soon as we can. Those Valkyries, I hope, aren't gonna be too terrible. Now, I guess we'll head over here. And again, same thing. Uh, actually, can my sentry reach? We can just normally attack or... Ooh. That's nice. Uh, it's not gonna reach the guy, unfortunately. God damn. All right, well, um, regardless of what happens, uh, if we get a really bad damage roll, it won't kill, but let's hope it will. Show me the honey, please. Oh, did not, but we still got him. So good. So luckily, phase two is now in service, although... Hmm. This isn't good. I need to attack one of them. I can't quite reach. I'd like to get into one of these pipes. Okay, whatever you say. <laughs> uh, Alright, so let's see if we can actually do some damage on this guy. Yeah, it's decent enough, I guess. And why not? We'll go for the shield. So I guess we're probably going to keep Peach on this side. Uh, oh, he's spawning enemies already. Also, three damage. Whoa. That was nice. All right. Please don't. Please don't do a thing. Good. Whew. And now you're moving. Yikes. What's going on? Oh, no. Okay, it didn't crit, at least. Whew. All right. Oh, now he's doing some protection stuff. Oh, no. All right. Um... Well, there's a couple of different things we could do here. He spawned bucklers, and the problem with this is they have the super chance, which is their guaranteed effect of pushing us. That's not good. Um, the spotlight is on. It's just hmm. So, uh, one of the things I screwed up was not giving Yoshi enough dashes. I only gave him enough for, uh, you know, 
a handful. I only gave him three, I think. So I was like, that is way too little. So I'm going to go and dash into this dude, if I can, please. Thank you. And then we'll go to this guy, probably. Why not? And then same thing over here. Uh, I want to keep one on a Mario, just in case. Uh, shoot, unless I want to try to get up as close to here as possible. So that I can get this next... Uh, next light as soon as I possibly can. But this guy, he's got the super effect of the bounce, so that would be a bad idea. Unless I scared him. <sighs> so many decisions, so little time. Alright, let's go do this. Jump down. And then probably just hang out right here for a minute. Uh, unless I have Mario. I don't even know if Mario can do the thing. Because if I get... Uh, I don't want to be so far away. But I also don't want to get pushed to infinity <laughs> and beyond. All right. I might have to do a dumb thing. But maybe not. All right. Let's 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 do let's do the sensible thing. How about that? We'll get this taken care of. And maybe I should just have Peach start coming over here to kind of help take out some of these guys. Because their super effect is something that I missed. I didn't realize that was going to be a thing. So, uh, this guy, he doesn't have really great odds either. Hmm. Well, maybe I should try to get this one. That might be a good idea. Unless Mario does a thing also. Uh, sure, let's try it. Yes! Oh my god, look at him go! <laughs> that was amazing. I've never seen that before. All right. Uh, I like that. Um, <laughs> Alright, Peach. I'm gonna need you to do some dirty work. Uh, unfortunately, we can't hang out here on the spotlights. I wonder. If I hang out right here, try to kill this guy, and then this one is gonna come to me, right? This will block me from being, like, bounced back, right? Is it bounce? Hmm. Allows me to keep my composure under the spotlight. I want to get the 100. Let's get rid of that as soon as we can. We'll come over here, and also we'll have a little bit of extra, extra stuff. This isn't gonna kill. Wow, I severely misjudged that. Um, sorry. Damn, I was holding out hope, man. All right, that's fine. And Mario, on the other hand, he can do some stuff. Don't need to go up there. We can actually land on him. That would be the smart thing to do. No? Let's try it. Boom. Yeah, I gave him a 70 on the stomp because I had it empty before. All right. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. I'm going to wait. This is dangerously close to him because if we look at this... We're going to be screwed. Alright, let's go over here. We'll land right here. Except this guy. What's his shot look like? Okay, so he can basically attack anyone. Uh, don't like that. Alright, let's do it. See what happens. I left that guy alive. Completely dis disregarded him. Uh, I wanted to go back to him. Uh... Oops. Well, uh, can lightning strike twice, perhaps? Oh, hell yeah, into the drink you go. Oh, that's not the end of the stage. 